Hi, I'm StormTracker 18 Weather Chief Meteorologist Matt Schaefer. We are getting hotter air approaching us from the west. Tomorrow's alerts do not extend into our area, but an excessive heat warning for the Twin Cities Metro and a heat advisory to the west. Near Fargo, it's in a heat watch still, but uh, that's where the core of the heat is going to be tomorrow. By Saturday, it's going to be right overhead, but we're still warming up nonetheless both days. For the muggy meter, it is going to be going up and really quickly already by Friday morning. They're going to be around the low to mid 60s, quickly rising around 4 o'clock in the afternoon to near 70 and staying near or even above 70 through the weekend. That's going to be feeling very humid and the heat's coming with it too. And we'll see when the best times for the heats are here on Futurecast because it all depends on the clouds and storm chances. Some clouds tomorrow morning that could result in a couple showers or storms. Futurecast thinks we'll stay dry. It's going to be close. That's why I only have a slight chance. Then by the afternoon, we're back into the sunshine. It starts to warm Warm up, but that could limit us for Saturday. Yes, there's a lot of storms approaching us Saturday morning, but they're going to stay away from us for just long enough, I think, to be able to warm up with at least enough sunshine peeking through these clouds, even into the afternoon around four o'clock. We're still on the edge of sunshine, so Eau Claire and South certainly looks warm to the north. It could be cooling off quickly, though it's still going to be humid regardless if the temperatures are only in the 80s or if they're in the low, perhaps even isolated mid 90s closer to La Crosse. But then these storms move through Saturday night. We could see some heavy rain and a small chance for severe storms again this weekend. So a lot coming in this hot, hot and humid air that is going to be arriving. Tonight's low 61. That's not too bad, especially with where we're going, but starting to feel a little bit muggy and really feeling humid tomorrow. High temperatures should be held in the 80s, but it's going to get close to 90 degrees. Partly cloudy, and there's going to be a slight chance of showers and storms in the morning as that warm front moves through. The heat index in the afternoon, especially if we're able to clear out, could exceed 90. A small chance of getting into the mid 90s. Most of us will feel probably by the low to mid 90s, like 93, 94 at the worst. So that's still pretty hot, not the hottest day this weekend. That comes Saturday. I know my forecast only has it another degree, but the humidity is likely going to be a little bit more. So it'll feel like the upper 90s Saturday with that shower and thunderstorm chance late in the day. Better chances where the showers and storms are likely are overnight into Sunday morning. Then a chance for scattered showers and thunderstorms to continue into Saturday afternoon as a cold front moves through. The humidity drops from Monday only a little bit humid and it gets better as the week goes on. Highs only in the low 80s, so more comfortable air on the way once we get past this weekend's humidity.